with Danny, their general manager, about some of the neat changes that they've made and the way that they pivoted in order to accommodate more people and keep their business open downtown. So Danny, tell us about your recent changes. So, you know, we're still doing the uh, takeout and uh, Viva Downtown and the city was gracious enough to give us a, uh, a uh, parking space just for us right out in front so you know you can pull right up we can see you through the window and we can run your food right out to you and then uh, we also are now seating on our expanded patio so our regular uh, fenced in patio had five yeah. seats so we've got nine tables total now so we had a couple flanking the patio on each side which is giving us a really cool um, area to come out and eat at uh, best thing about us is with our patio it's always in the shade yeah. with the exception of maybe one or two tables in the middle of the afternoon but it's always cool out there it's always nice it's always shady and we're just doing anything and everything we can to keep going and be positive and just you know get through this absolutely so i'm going to walk you guys outside for a minute we are not doing the video outside because they're currently having the sidewalks pressure wash so it's a little loud but i do want to show you guys their patio real quick Downtown. I'm trying to watch it. No, it's um, reopen Reading or something like that. I'll share it to you. And so you can see they've got some extra tables set up out here. They've got the tables within the patio. And then they also set up a great waiting space. Let's go back inside so you can hear me again. <laughs> outside on the sidewalk where people if they're waiting for a table they can hang out you can serve them drinks out there correct yep that's true okay. yeah so it's kind of cool it's like a nice little European feel we have going on downtown um, and you know we're really enjoying it it's been a lot of fun it's kind of right. it's kind of different but it's you know it's fun yeah making the best of it yeah absolutely now, I know that you guys said you're you know you're making sure that you comply with all of the orders right now and because of your concerns about going into the winter with outdoor dining so tell us a little bit about that so um, you know we want to make sure we're doing anything and everything that we possibly can to keep the public safe and to keep our all of our customers safe um, but uh, now is the time to do this uh, especially for other restaurants that maybe not be complying because what's going to happen is is we're either all going to get shut down again or we're still only going to be able to sit inside when it comes uh winter time and if people can only sit outside in the winter when it's raining it it's not going to be good for anybody right. so um you know we really just want to make sure we're doing anything and everything we possibly can to get through this situation and move back into you know, normal dining experience that we used to do. Sure, absolutely. So I know that's a concern for a lot of restaurants that we've talked to and the idea that they're all, you know, doing the best that they can right now to um, maintain their, their business and to stay open to get through this crisis. And, but the idea that going into the winter months and only having outdoor dining is a huge concern because it's, we know it's hard to sit outside when it's 110, but we still do it. Um, it would be very difficult to do that and enjoy your dinner if you're sitting outside in the rain. So I'm um, really proud of Vintage and how they've kind of changed their business model to accommodate and to be able to stay within compliance, to keep their customers and their employees safe, and to keep their business operating downtown. So tell us about your hours. So we're open for lunch Tuesday through Friday, 11 to 2. And then we're open for dinner uh, Tuesday through Saturday, uh, 4 to 9. OK, yeah. perfect. And they have a lot of different options for you to support their business and help them stay downtown. I know there's a lot of changes going on downtown. And so we really want to see Vintage stay here. They've been here for a really long time. And we want to make sure that they're here as these down changes happen downtown so that we can continue to enjoy the downtown area and their food and their amazing bar as well. And Sunday live music. And Sunday live music. Someday. Hopefully we get that back soon. <laughs> yes, definitely. Something to look forward to. 
So a lot of different options on how you can support them. Obviously, you can come down for lunch or dinner and enjoy their outdoor patio. You can also do takeout, and they have curbside delivery with a designated spot, so you don't have to worry about parking downtown to pick up your food. And then you can also do delivery through Entree Express still as well, correct? That is correct, yes. Okay, perfect. So they are located at 1790 Market Street, right on the corner of, what is this, Market and? Sacramento. Sacramento. <laughs> couldn't remember at all. Um, and you can also call in your order for either takeout or delivery to 229-9449. Nailed it. All right, perfect. So give them a like on Facebook. We've tagged their page. Please share this video. We want as many people as possible to see it and really help them promote their business, help them stay here, help them stay busy during this time and keep their doors open while we all get through this together. So. Danny, thank you so much for having us. Thanks for coming. And by the way, I heard that they have new dessert, so that is worth coming in and trying. If you haven't been here in a while, new dessert menu. So super important to some of us that need our sugar fix during this time. So come on down and try them. Enjoy their outdoor patio. Order online for takeout or delivery. Not order online. Call them, 229-9449, for takeout or delivery. Thank you so much, you guys, and we will see you tomorrow.